There's a military base just south of here. All right, let's move. Everyone stay together. Hi everybody, hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of the Two Custom Co-ops maps. We're playing Deadbeat Escape by Mendoxes, or something along those lines. Once again joined by Stanley and Chester, say hello. Hello. Let's get this party going. I think this is a fairly recently released map, because I haven't seen it before and it was pretty high up there in the ranking. Okay. Didn't got a lot of votes yet. No. But, well, it looks better than some of the worst maps out there we've played so far. Oh, yeah. Some of the worst. Come on, that boat. That yeah, that was pretty crappy. And. Whoa, okay. Oh, did you see that? You just slid right past it. Gill shot. Oh. Oops. What? What? What did you do? do anything. Been a while since I played video games. Mm. Need to come back to the swing of things. What? We need to come back into the swing of things. Yes. Eh, it's like riding a bike. Reloading. Yeah, true. Killing zombies, riding a bike. Basically the same thing, right? Oh yeah. So like. Also, it's been a while since I've done some, uh, you know, more of the hardcore gaming. Since I started playing on console. Ah, uh, well, the console has hardcore gaming in it. Yeah, but I'm not playing like Grand Theft Auto, it's not really that hardcore. Mm. Aimbots and stuff like that. I'll never learn. <laughs> oh, video game. I suppose it is. What? There he is. Oh, there he is. There you go. <laughs> That's what you get for picking Lewis. <laughs> That's racist. I never said that was what you get for taking the black one. I just said that's what you get for taking Lewis. Emphasizing that he's black. Now I did, because you didn't get it. Ammo. Who is the one that always gets left behind? Why? Because he's black. You're a bunch of racists. No. Poach is the one who gets left behind. Yeah, there's two black Most ones of the time. There. Where's your logic now? Nobody needs to They just bullets? put Rochelle in because it was racist. So there wouldn't be a minority in the game. There's still only one woman in it. Can't put two women in it. <laughs> It'll become a cooking show. Zombie Cooking Friday with your host, Rochelle and Zoe. Today, you take Mitch. one zombie and two eggs. You throw the eggs. Throw them up the nicely. <laughs> And you blend them. Smoothie stand would be enough. Yes. Ooh, nice. Hank? Yes. Oh, yeah. oh Johnny! What? Oh, you still have that mod going? Yes. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> Never gonna get tired of that one. Try to take a screenshot of that and I'll uh, muck it in. I can't do it because Fine. of the sound, but you know, screenshot probably won't hurt too much. Okay. 
For as long as I can. Oof. Found a thing. Bunker or something. Ooh, that's nice. Oh. Might need a half life. But have to squash bugs. How many were there? 300? 300? Too much. 50? Something. Um. Then you miss one. Yup. What? You only miss one? Yeah. You get an achievement for getting all of them in a single go. And if you then end up missing one, that's enough to throw your computer through the window. <laughs> Half of the time it's the one hiding in the closet. Yeah, I heard of that one. Yeah, you do it once. Not even where you're supposed to find most of them. It's like, you find like all of them in one place and then that one... Uh, it's yeah. hidden, like, where you'd never suspect it, somewhere in a closet or something, a whole uh, different level. The one in the closet is at the beginning, but there is indeed one that once you think, you come back at where you start thinking, oh crap, I missed one, and there's actually one past that point. Reloading. Yeah, I heard about that one. Left never got that achievement. I did, but I have to had to try it once again, I think. Get some grub. Yep. So you tried it, you fail, and you try it again. Yep. Talk about persistence. Hey, that's achievement hunting. No, but that's great. I got the one at the end. And I still end up... Ooh, who got... No, no one got grabbed. Ended up missing one. So I look at a guide, and I went, Oh, it's that motherfucker. <laughs> Probably the one that most people miss at the beginning. The one in the claws or not? Yeah, the one in. Because before that, there's really no point in opening those damn things. You didn't even know you could. And then suddenly, hey, look at that. You have to open one to get the thing. <laughs> yeah. Pills here. Ooh, fatty. Oh, well, looks like I found him. Oh yeah. Oh, dude, dude, dude. Reloading. Yeah. Oof, I'm mad, kid. I'm still good. Francis can pick one up if he's not an idiot. Damn, did he pass a melee weapon? Oh somewhere? crap! What? And that's good. Nom, Shit, nom, 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 nom. Now I got two pistols. All right, med kits up here or uh, upstairs. Yeah, let's see if we can aid kit over here. Try to get over here and see if Francis will pick it up if we're all here. Come on, Francis. Francine. Come on. Yeah, you go. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there you go. My God. <laughs> Uh, him stuff. To really get that mod going that uh, smartens up the AI. I oh, read a few things about it. Apparently it really helps you know, when they use medkits and stuff like that. I don't think they got it to a point where they actually start throwing grenades. Would be useful. Could be annoying as well. Yeah. Let's go through that door. Anytime I throw the Molotov in the door. Ooh, there's a bottle of piss over there. Bad little midget. Johnny, right. Secure that weapon. Where? Reloading. Someone's gonna get grabbed. Probably. Nope. Nope. Oop. He died. Oh yeah. Ooh, big red thing. Aww. Push it. It's not a button. Kick it. Not a ball. There is no kick button. Yeah. Dance, monkey, dance! Uh -huh. On my head. Sort of work. 
Ooh, safe train. Train of sea. Well, now we know where the zombies are at. Cover me. Gotta save the gas can. Of course you do. Tremendous. All right. Beat a that was pretty nice. Yep, so far so good. Looked like I did pick a good map. Then again, the first yes. map is a showcase, and two, three, and four can be rushed. Down the drain it goes. <laughs> yep. Well, the first map decent. It can still go away down before it actually gets terrible. Lewis is idle. Look at that. Everyone's idle. Nope. Nope. There we go. I'm idle. What? Nope. Yeah. What? I was Fid idle. Idle. Ideal. That's what it said. Oh. Hans <laughs> was ideal. Yes, he was. <laughs> <laughs> then he started playing. And things <laughs> went bad quickly. Francis, what the fudge are you doing? Shooting me. Oh. Fell in a hole. Well, it's a hole you're used to. Yeah, there it is. For people who don't know what I'm saying, I work on trains. Feeling right at home. My hole doesn't look like that. No. A bit cleaner. Not that comfortable patch of dirt in the corner. I use a wheelbarrow to sleep in. Uh, sure. Got a nice fluffy pillow in there. And, uh... <laughs> Reloading. Other gunk. I just roll up my vest and use it as a pillow. Sure. Oop. What? Uh, need to know basis. <laughs> I do a lot of work. Yes. There's never any time for sleep. <laughs> Let it be known to the world. <clears throat> I work my ass off from 7 to 4. <laughs> Just a pistol. This continues to be a pretty decent map. Yep, so far so good. That's the good thing about having Reloading. a critical audience. Well, audience. Who <laughs> rates these maps anyway? Who what? Rate? Uh, who, yeah, who rates these? Community. Yeah. Community. Oh. The beautiful thing about a good community. Good. Now, yeah, you could learn from that. Yeah, they could. <laughs> yeah, you yeah, could learn a lot of things. Yeah, like, like uh, customer finishing support. a game before bringing it out. Finishing a game before releasing a sequel. Yep. And they once getting well in between brackets a war for that. Yeah, they did. Golden turd or something. Yeah, something in those lines. That was beautiful. The other thing they went over there to collect it though. No, it's still co collecting dust. I think. <laughs> uh, I would get it. Put it on my desk. Look what I made. People would be amazed for shit about a gold, gold turd. turd encrusted with People would come and kidnap you. Then I will beat him to death with a gold turd. What would happen if you had diarrhea? Then you get the golden splat. 
<laughs> Coal dust. <laughs> Reloading. Uh. Reloading. Here we on Discovery Channel. Man, shit. Gold, gold diggers. Go ah, <laughs> man. <laughs> I have to say diggers Diff after that. Diff shit, eh? Uh, well, I just gave a new meaning, bull diggers. Gay people. There any gold in here? Start up the wash plant. <laughs> Start the drill. What drill? You know, going on from the gay. Your ass is my claim. No, please. I got a nice claim on this fat piece of ass. Hope there's some gold in it. Uh huh. You there are a lot of special effects here on Hoffman's crew's coming for your ass. <laughs> uh, their reputation. There is not gonna be any gold in your ass either. <laughs> or they are. Got it. Reloading. That was going a bit too far. Ooh. Well, if it were, were to be an American show, they would find it at the end of your colon. Like, oh my god, there's yeah, and there would be and a gigantic deadline. We need to find gold now. Look at that, at the tip of the colon. Oh. We only have four days left of digging. Weapons here. Oh, Ooh, laser sights. Oh, great. Now we're gonna f find some better weapons around the corner. That's good. I'm good. Yes, something like that. Oh. Yeah, it is a hunter. What are doing over there? Crowbar. Bitter still gross me out. I think it's the face. It's the ass. But the face looks like, you know. Reloading. Well, the guy from American History X? No. No, for the face you need, still need some imagination. The ass is just plain there. <laughs> but once you see it, it's there forever. Yeah. Johnny. No, John. Bad John. Watch where you're shooting. It is John. Ooh, which? Anyone got a shotgun? Oop. Got a gas can. Uh, I think that works actually. But I'm gonna let you fire it just in case. I have. Uh, there's a um, gas. The other type of gas can. Other type what? of gas, and we were talking about <laughs> ass recently. I mean. <laughs> That oh, Francis did well. it. Francis did it. If it was one of mine, it would. Here we go. Back on your feet, soldier. You're not getting out of this fight that easy. Well done, Francis. Thanks, brother. Lucky <laughs> I'm playing Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> well, Francis is indestructible, so. You know, that's, yes, so you know, that's the reason why Bill got off in the. Uh, Passing, right? Why? Who said so? Nope. Think about it. They couldn't have killed Lewis, because that would be racist. Couldn't kill Zoe, because that would be feminist. Couldn't kill Francis, because he's indestructible. Oh. Mm -hmm. Think about it. That doesn't make any sense. Yes, it does. They couldn't kill you normally, because you're like a war veteran. People should have respect You know how America you. treats its veterans? Yeah, often. Yeah. Well, that's what we see in the media and cartoons and stuff like that. I know it's still there. Don't want to offend anyone, but... Yeah, before it rains down, comments on the channel. <laughs> yes, America is great! There's nothing <laughs> wrong with it. Yo, well, before you know it, they'll start calling you a terrorist. 
What terrorist? Who? Where? Kill him! Shoot him! Because that's what you do in America. You do like your neighbors, call them a terrorist and call the police. <laughs> They'll take him off to Guantanamo, you'll never see him again. <laughs> My That's five, what I heard. My five-year-old just shat his bed. He's a terrorist. <laughs> Take him away, boys. Lewis, use your first aid kit. Oh, jeez. That man wouldn't give me a seat on the bus. He's a terrorist. Get him. Yeah. More bombs, huh? Let's see if there's anything out there. Grenade! Boom, well, there goes the neighborhood. <laughs> All of it. It's everywhere now. Yeah, you better hold it. Ow. Reloading. Well, didn't it? The fuel tank. What are you doing there floating in the air? You can't do that. <laughs> Man, hope Reloading. you find some better weapon suit. Yeah, I'm running around with two pistols. Two pistols and a crowbar. Oh, machine gun and a crowbar. Guns. Ooh, guns and guns. Anything good or just the usual? Usual. Anything is better. I'm gonna keep with my laser pointer. Weapons over here. Yeah. Ooh, giant excavator. For digging gold. Now let's stop doing that now. I think that would fit up your ass. Swiggity shooty for that booty. Ooh, found some better weapons. Someone left the fridge open. Francis, could you just like yeah, there you go? That's ah, the end of that weapon. Yeah, there's a new weapon here. In the fridge, I oh, know. There was a pile of ammo a while ago. Like, like 50 meters ago. Wow. Going up high. What? Where the hell are you? There they are. On the roof. The roof. The roof. Reloading. The roof is on fire. Ow. Jump. Do it. Oh, you actually did it. Oh. You know I like a challenge. Goodbye, cruel world. Uh huh. Oh. Baby room. Ah, shoot it. Imagine that. Trying to commit suicide, jump off a roof, and there's a roof right next to you, and just fall flat on your face and live. And people see. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, tricycle. Yeah, try not to get killed on that. You know, moving parts usually don't mix well with that for dead. I know. Wasn't the tricycle also very bad in Killing Floor? Reloading. Yeah, that thing was just badly placed. It didn't move to still be... Francis is in the corner. The very naughty. Naughty Francis. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to show support by commenting, like, and or subbing. Thank you, Chester and Stanley, for playing. No problemo. And we'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone. Bye.